Hey, what's going on guys? Shadow here, and today I'm back with Chronicle Mode in the Jaguar E-Type. You all know I hate this car, it's just really, really weird with physics, and like it spins out a lot for no reason, it's sort of slow, but not slow at the same time, but uh, yeah, I think we can get this done pretty easily as long as we don't run into like a Corvette at the start, because that thing will just smoke us in the straight and in the turns, so yeah, let's get started. Uh, yeah, sorry for being away for a couple days, guys. I've been helping a friend with a video project of his for his channel, uh, so yeah, I haven't been, uh, recording because of that and just being busy in general, but let's just get right into this. Alright, Z28, Europa, GTR, alright. Standard lineup, we should be able to win this pretty easily. Standard start. Go up the hill. There we go. Past the Europa. Very nice. Should be decently smooth sailing from here on out. Except for this thing's horrendous oversteer and understeer at almost the same time. Like there, we're getting a little bit of oversteer for no reason. And if I try to turn here, I'm gonna get a little bit of understeer. And that Z28 is still right there. This thing's definitely gonna need tires, suspension upgrade, and then we can start off the power. It already has a, well, like 264 or something, so doesn't need that much power. Oh god, understeer! Jeez. That was some crazy understeer right there. Yeah, not even a second on the Z28. We got to beat the Z28 on the straight. Oh, the oversteer. Come on. Looks like we're pulling. Just barely, but we are. Break a little early because of the understeer. There we go, second lap. Very nice. Yeah, this thing, like, the rear steps out so much really bothersome. It looks like we've gotten a decent lead so far guys. We've got to keep it. So let's not spin out, let's not go into grass, you know, stuff like that. Oh, or even spin out like that, that would be embarrassing. We got a break here because of the understeer. Oh yeah, we've got a nice lead now. We should be able to win this pretty easy. There we go. A little bit of skidding. Getting to break here too. Wish we can actually get around that corner nice. This is a decently nice looking car, but it just doesn't perform well. That's the only thing I don't like about it. There we go, very nice. The third, and across the line. There we go, clear. Get out of the replay. Stage one clear. There's our first win. Now we definitely need some tires. Definitely need some tires. Alright, on to the 80s. Let's begin.
Alright, pretty standard lineup. I'm going up against the Celicon, 2.0 GT. Alright. Didn't get the launch control start again. That's fine. The tires do help with the oversteer a bit. Not much with the understeer though. But we can keep up with this quattro. We can and we will. Up the inside on the quo oh god. I caused an accident. Well, kind of he caused the accident because he went in my line, but uh, whatever. That Celica's coming up fast. Getting aggressive over there. Let me just sneak past this Renault. Oh, no, no. Okay, I guess not. Sneak up on him right here, though. Nope. Come on. That thing is decently quick. There we go, past them right here. There we go. Breaking hard. Shifting a little early. That's fine. There we go, nice through there. Got a Renault 5. On the Celica, right behind me. Hitting the red line for a second there, whoops. Just break a little bit through here. Just getting out just a little bit. Understeer. Through the sand. Oops. Shifting a little early there again. Down shifting early. Right, we're starting to make some gap. 2.5 seconds on the Celica now. The shifting on this thing kind of bothers me. It goes so low in gear. In the third, come on. Actually going in uh, the sand there. Very hard. The Celica making up some gap, but it's not going to be enough. You should be able to get to the finish before he catches. It's getting out a little bit again. Give me a second. Coming up on the final stretch. Shifted into third, and across the line. Very nice. Two second lead. Kind of less, but there we go. Now, I'm not even going to get a turbo yet. I'm going to go for suspension just to try and help stabilize so we don't oversteer as much and we don't slide as much. Then we'll go for the uh, turbo next time. Hey, what's going on guys? Shadow here. And uh, the game kind of crashed while I was doing the E-Type. So uh, I just redid it up to the part where it crashed, which was late 80s. So we're going to go do that now. So uh, yeah, let's go. Yeah, A86. This is going to be stressful things so fast uh. all right guys well let's just do our best and hope we win damn it if we didn't hit that guy would have had a great start oh this thing is so sluggish oh that was nice we might have a chance here. Nope. Come on. 
If things do not have bad but when that A86 catches up, we're gonna have problems. Come on. Oh crap. That's not good. We need to go fast, but that A86 is right there. I think it's gonna pass us like right at the finish line, I have a feeling. There it is. Well, it's battling with the mid four, so that's good for us. Well, we might actually win this. Oh, the holder steer. Oh yeah, we might be lucky. A86 won't catch up because he's stuck behind the mid four. Oh, this oversteer is killing me. Come on! Come on! We're almost there. Across the line. Very nice. There we are, clear, five points. Very nice. There we go, clear. Very nice. Alright. Now let's get a turbo. There we go. Now we can start getting some speed in this thing. But, it's the early 90s, and you guys know what that means. This is where I'm going to cut the first video. So, uh, hope you guys enjoyed. I'm Shadow, and I'm out. See you guys.